A beekeeping company says it has suffered a significant loss after millions of bees were tossed from hives during a crash this morning. Action News Jack's Princess on Severson reports it happened in Baldwin when a tractor trailer collided into a truck carrying an estimated 5 million bees. These are images from Tuesday morning's crash in Baldwin on I-10 and U.S. Highway 301 after a tractor trailer ran into this truck carrying millions of bees. There are no turn signals, so there was no way that he had a green turn signal that would have given me a red light. And he was, he was trying to make a U-turn in, in an area that would be hard to make one anyway. This is Trent Paget. He's a beekeeper for Day's Bee Company in Broxton, Georgia, and he's one of the drivers involved in this morning's accident. Fortunately, no one was hurt, but the impact sent many of those bees swarming. And then we couldn't get out the, the door on my side because the, the front side was, was caved in, so you know, came out the passenger side. Paget and two of his co-workers were passing through Baldwin trying to get to Lottie to make some honey when the semi truck crashed into them, throwing over 100 beehives, each carrying around 50,000 bees. That's about 5 million bees swarming around the Baldwin area. I lost equipment that it's not easy to replace. You know, uh, we lost a good truck. We lost a lot of bees. Paget and his crew of beekeepers have rescued as many of their bee colonies as they could. They did leave one behind like this one you see in front of me. Paget is hoping that by doing so, the bees that have wandered off will one day return home. He will come back in a few days to check on them. He says this morning's traffic accident left significant but undetermined loss to the bee colonies and the beekeeping company. We're going to try to go through and see what is OK. There's a lot of dead bees on the highway. For local coverage you can count on in Baldwin, I'm Princess Johnny Steverson, Action News Jacks.